church it is so cold it's like 20 degrees and my face is freezing and just from walking to the car and we're supposed to get a bunch of snow tomorrow John did his good deed for Sunday he filled up my gas tank <laughs> uh, can't have you stranded out there having to pump gas in the cold all right guys we just got back I'm getting ready to do some cooking I usually make a big meal after church on Sundays at lunchtime and then we just eat something small a little later at dinner time so I'll share everything I'm making with you. I wanted to say thank you to Universal Music Group for sponsoring this video. I'm so excited because I'm a huge country music fan and I love Little Big Town. And Little Big Town just came out with a new album called The Breaker. I've been listening to the songs from this album and I think you guys will really like it. You can download it from iTunes. My favorite so far is Happy People and that song was playing at the beginning of this video. I love the tune of it but I really like the words and if you know my personality and what I try to promote, that song fits perfectly. So I listen to that song a lot of times when I'm just doing stuff around the house. It's just such a great song and really upbeat and I love the words to it. You have probably heard Better Man on the radio and that was written by Taylor Swift and there's some other really great songs in here. Beat Up Bible is one of my favorites so definitely check it out. Um, I think you'll really enjoy it and you again can download it from iTunes and I will leave a link below. All right, I need to get cooking some lunch. I was talking to my boys and cooking a perfect Sunday afternoon for me, right? So here's the chicken I am cooking. I have olive oil, lemon juice, fresh basil, fresh parsley, a couple cloves of minced garlic, salt, and pepper in there. And I think that's all. And then we're going to have it with tahini. I'm also going to be making some green beans and I'm working on a salad. And then I have some rice cooking over here as well. I didn't show myself cooking much because I was talking to my boys and my boys come first because I'm a mama first. <laughs> but this is the salad I made. It's kind of like a Middle Eastern salad or my take on it anyway. And I did show how to make it in one of my What I Ate Today videos. So I'll link that below and I'll try to put the timestamp just in case you want to see how to make it. But it's really simple. It's uh, lettuce, cucumber, tomato, fresh parsley garlic green onion and then the dressing is just lemon juice and olive oil and it's really good and refreshing so dinner is ready we're having the chicken that i told you about with tahini i really like the tahini from trader joe's and then rice i added a little bit of olive oil to that some garlic lemon juice lemon pepper salt parsley and pine nuts and then i have green beans i love sauteing green beans with a little olive oil lemon juice and then garlic salt and pepper and then we have our salad there is lunch good it was very good you can see that i've been part of the clean plate club for as long as i can remember <laughs> i think i'm a founding member actually yeah you think so <laughs> that was very good all right clean up time it isn't too bad i do try to clean up as i cook but sometimes I get talking to my family and sometimes you're trying to do stuff at the last minute. So a little bit of mess. I'm going to try to clean up as soon as I can because we like to rest on Sunday afternoons and we had the time change today and I am at the end of my book and it's so good. So I can't wait to finish it up. So that's extra incentive to get moving.
right, everything is cleaned up. It's super bright and sunny, but it's still cold. But I'll take the sunshine. Josh is just going to unload the dishwasher once that's done. And that's it, all cleaned up. All right, time to rest and read my book. I was talking about Tana French in my favorites video, and I had just started reading this one, and I'm on 425, and I think it goes to 466, so I don't have that much left, but I'll probably fall asleep since we had the time change. I'm a little tired, so anyway, I'm going to rest and read my book. I caught John getting a second piece of chocolate cake. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> it's already eight. I can't believe it. The time change. Did I do that? <laughs> they have a Christian's birthday cake. Can you believe we have a 19 year old? I don't think that's legal. No. <laughs> Not for us. Do any of you guys have a 19 year old? Or teenagers. It's like, how is he old? already 19? Only one more year until he's 20. Not a teenager anymore. The good thing about having a 19 year old is you get birthday cake. Yeah. I think Josh ate all the ice cream. <laughs> I wasn't happy to see all the ice cream gone. Yeah. It didn't last long. Mm -hmm. And I couldn't eat any of it cookies and cream ice cream so so I need to go to Trader Joe's and Costco tomorrow so I'm writing out my menu and my grocery list I might just finish it tomorrow because I can't believe how late it is already the time change it's just like how is it this late so anyway I have my recipe binder here I have a video on this and I keep getting asked where I get my recipes from. And if I share them with you guys, unless I give credit to someone, it's something that I just made up on my own. I love to cook, love to play in the kitchen and make up recipes. So I actually last week just bought a bunch of stuff and made a bunch of dinners that I didn't have a recipe for that I had never made. And it was super fun just playing and tasting until I got it right. That's one of my favorite things to do. So sometimes I do that from time to time and I might even leave a few spots to do that again because I really like just being creative in the kitchen. So anyway, that's what I'm doing right now. So the only remaining question is, are you going to hang out with me tonight? Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> that's our every night uh, line. Sometimes we have to go through that several times. Yeah. Just to confirm that we're, we're actually going to hang out tonight. Yeah, you have to have little cute wines that you share with your spouse, right? Do you guys have any cute wines like that? We always say that, like every day. Are you going to hang out with me tonight? And if we're feeling really tired, I tell her to put her Let's Stay Home shirt on. <laughs> and just call it a night. Yeah.